Now we're going to do, if you were normally, if you were flushing the system, you would do this twice. You would do it once for about 30 seconds or a minute till the 10 quarts of fluid is through the system. And then the second time around, you would do it for the full 15 minutes after the new filter is in and the system has been full. You don't, you would reconnect the line, you would put the line back on the reservoir, top off the fluid, and then let it run through its full 15 minute cycle. Yeah, it runs for about 15 minutes. So we're gonna go to actuations. The filter, the filter is in the top of the reservoir, so you would unscrew the top of the reservoir and the filter would be right there. Okay, so I'm gonna go ahead and hit rodeo. I'm gonna press start, here we go. Yeah, they, they call it rodeo now, before it used to be called some German acronym. Now this is another way to possibly give the pump a little bit of a workout. This car seems to be going pretty good. If the pump drops below about 100 bar, it stops, the procedure stops. If you see it repeatedly doing that, it might be another indication that your pump is failing or on its way out. So just imagine trying to fill up nine quarts of fluid while the car's dancing around like this. <laughs> 